Thanks, Meg. Wine enthusiasts rejoice. Beaujolais Nouveau 2013, it is now available. Can you hear those wine glasses clinking right now? Here to tell us all about the first tasting in America <laughs> is Bob Burke. He's the owner at Patafio. And Bob, you're coming off of a, a wild night last night. We had a wild night. We were the first people in North America to drink the George de Boeuf Beaujolais Nouveau Thursday is the, the third Thursday of November mm -hmm. is the first day that you can drink the Beaujolais from the new harvest. So this wine was on the vine in August. They pressed it in September. They mm -hmm. bottled it in October. And we are the first to drink it one second past midnight last night at Potofura. We pulled the corks and we had a great time. Now, of course, we'd been drinking other wines <laughs> for two hours before that. But this was special, though. It was though. really great. So and why does we're this one have this stand this out? Morning. OK, yeah. Okay. So as you pour, what makes this well, wine so special? The, why, why is the anticipation building each year for this? Because Congress made the fourth Thursday of November, by law, is, of course, Thanksgiving. Yes, it is. So when the French decided what day they should allow the Beaujolais Nouveau to be released, they made the law the third Thursday of November. So yep. let's just say that Mr. DeBoeuf's warehouses are empty and his bank account is full. <laughs> Beautiful. Well, cheers to you. And it's it great with turkey. It smells nice. Yeah, you were saying mm -hmm. this release is kind of nice because you can buy it for the holidays, and a lot of people might not think of, of red wine with turkey. Exactly. And it's nice and light. It's a little fruity. Give that a taste. Mm. It is light. Isn't that? Oh, that's So that that's will go nice great mix. on Thanksgiving. And the thing about Beaujolais is, is this. Don't put it, don't lay it down and expect it to age. You want to be done with this by Drink New Year's. Drink this one soon. <laughs> this is a wine you want to marry, you, you want to date, not marry. Okay? okay. It's just for fun and a good time. Mm -hmm. And it's you'll see it in liquor stores all over Rhode Island, Southern New England today. Yep. And George DeBoeuf, nobody makes it better than George. And we're going to have a wheelbarrow race. We're racing the Biltmore. And that's why we've got the wheelbarrow. Yes, it's starting uh, sharply at 10 o'clock this morning. And every year um, for, for the, since 1987, we have, we have run to try to beat the Biltmore. Hopefully today we're going to clobber them. And then tonight at Pont au Four, we've got a barrel of Beaujolais, and we're going to tap the barrel. Everybody gets to put their glass How under fun. the spigot and drink from the barrel. We've got a big celebration. So come on down all weekend long. We'll be celebrating the arrival of the Beaujolais Nouveau. You mentioned this race. between Is it between Pont au Four and the Biltmore? And the Biltmore, the American team versus the French team. It's a it's ah. a real grudge match. And can anyone go see Yeah, the race? we'll be right on the river by the Gatsby kiosk across from Hemingway's. We'll be mm -hmm. right on the river racing at 10 o'clock. And, uh, you know, they got 200 employees and they walk around going like, you look fast. And I got, you know, like 11 people. And they clobber us every year. But this year... Maybe this year you'll get We're going to give them a thumping. We okay. really are. We're going to beat the... Here, Get ready, Biltmore. We're beating you this morning. You heard it I'm first right down. here on the road show. I'm Bob is uh, throwing threats out there. <laughs> this is really nice. And like you said, it's, pro it's affordable, too. Yeah. And what's cool about it, every year they do a different, really cool label. It's always colorful. It's always fun. You put this out on your holiday table, and mm -hmm. it's great. People, you know, it's just fun at this time of year to have the new harvest. And this harvest was actually pretty tough. It took forever for them to finally get it to flower and set. Mm -hmm. And it was the latest set when they did it since... 1983. Wow, so this is a special one this then. If you pick one. this up, uh, you're getting a little piece of history right here. Cheers to you, Bob. Thank Cheers. you so much and best of luck. Watch out, Beltmore. He's coming for you. If you want to enjoy some of the magnifique <laughs> happenings to celebrate Beaujolais Nouveau today, we're going to post more information on our website. It's the Roadshow page at WPRI.com.